selfishness always make you lose point. Everything that concentrate to try to get things for yourself alone, you lose everything. Whereas if you try to serve other people with love and with unconditional devotion, you gain. Yeah, that's the irony of the universe. Because whenever you offer yourself to other people, you one person, you expand. You understand me? Your energy, your aura expand at least into that person area. But everything you think of yourself, oh, I need this, I want all this for yourself. Then it's just like this, just this. Yeah. The more, the more you serve, the more you expand. You're bigger. I told you 20 years already. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, good, good. Master, oh, you speak so nice. But you don't even understand. You don't even practice what I told you. Then it's a waste of time. I don't mean you especially. We're just talking in general, okay? For the people who still have this lingering trouble of selfishness and ego, just drop it. Especially, especially when you come here and you see me already, that's the best already you can get, so just drop everything else. You come here, it's enough. Even just to look at me, enough. The people outside, the people who don't even practice meditation, if they just look into the Master's eyes once, they get millions of points already. And how much you get, but you've been wasting, wasting, wasting. You understand me? You're wasting it because I give you something, you go out and waste it because it's so easy to get. And you come here and grab for more. The more you grab, the more you lose. This is a very uh, paradox law of the universe, but it is like that. You're very fortunate already. Even if I don't see you, I don't talk to you, you had enough already. But because the mind is troubling everybody, so I try to come out again telling you the same stuff, hoping that now that you're already high level, and the word is high, you will understand better. Do you understand better? Yes. <laughs>